All right, loose coins here, everyone. Hope everyone's enjoying their weekend. Been busy here with the nice weather, getting front fence done and back woods cleaned up. So those projects are coming along pretty good. Um, got a long overdue mail day and pickup. So let's just get this started. A couple months ago when I was at the coin shop looking around, my local coin shop, see what they had down there. I did pick this up. Um, Lincoln Memorial coinage. So they're all real nice. Only paid ten bucks for it, but this way. There we go. That's going to be a nice little wall hanger for me. And then, oh, okay, let me see. Oh, yeah. I did get a lot from uh, Ken PV at one of his auctions. A um, bunch of 1950s BU AU wheat pennies for, for my book. Um, sorry, I already put them in my book, but they are pretty. So I'm getting, I'm getting my holes filled up. I still got a long ways to go on this, but I'm also trying to put a high grade set together. I have enough dated pennies on this side of me, and I got a whole bunch back here that are in flips. I can complete the book, but I'm working on a high grade set minus minus the, the key dates, so. Hopefully, I'll have this done early next year, time frame. Um, all right, we are at the list. I also picked up an item from Lemonhead Penny. 1944S, one centavo, little dye variety on it. And with well, my little pointer out there, my little, I got a little pointer here. And on the last four, it's missing one of the legs that come out. So I got that. This is real nice, real nice condition. I'm happy with this. I am trying to get World War II coinage when we were in certain countries and we came up with coinage so one side says the United States of America had a little emblem on it and then the back side is one centavo Nice little add-on. Let's see, where else am I? Ah. Mantic Coins. Um, thank you for coming to our live stream and hanging out with us. We sure, we sure love and having you around. Adriana found a treasure in your role and I Hope you'll enjoy the coin and see you again soon. Um, 1974 Kennedy 50 cent piece and has a die crack. I haven't even taken it out of the 
of the envelope yet. I do have a red box back here on my bottom shelf. Anything that I've gotten from a live stream gets put inside that red box for me to enjoy. It will never be sold. It'll be never given away. I cherish every bit of these coins. So let's open this up and see if we could actually see the die crack. I lost one of my cameras. I can't get it to work with the uh, OBS. It just won't pick it up. It'll work fine on any computer, but I can't get it to work, so keep that and I believe the die crack was on the on the back side. Maybe it was the front side. Yeah, the back side. I might have to look at the video, the stream to figure out where it was again. I don't remember, but let's see. there's the back side, and the front side. This, this cam is actually my thousand time magnifier. And I just got it up in the air, the shooting down, so I get a little something to show. So that goes in there. And then, this is from uh, Scott, Hoogie's Hoggle Hobby Shop. This is uh, Eric. We, in... Hope you enjoyed the live stream on Sunday. This was during the last coin seminar. It says, please accept this coin as a very small gesture of our appreciation for your service in the U.S. Air Force. See you around, Scott. And he sent me a 2018 one ounce silver. I believe these are the, the, silver, the, the silver eagles. Very beautiful coin. Another one that I will treasure and forever. I gotta get, I wanna put this in one of those snap lock round cases as soon as I get some. I believe that was it. Uh, a couple weeks ago, I was on an online auction for a coin company. I don't know if I'll use them again because their shipping is slow as hell. But I did pick up 230 Buffalo nickels of uh, full to partial dates. So I'm going to be going through these and seeing what's available in them. So that's going to be a lot of fun for the upcoming week coming up. Um, I sure wish I was able to live stream. My internet will not support it right now. We do have a company putting in DSL and they already got the lines 
set up all the way across the all the service areas they're doing and they're putting in their stations to support everything. They're saying late December, early January time frame when they get everything completed. So I am going to have DSL. I'm going to have great internet. And I'm going to be able to start live streaming. So I'm very excited about that. So... I think I got everybody. We got Hobies and my Buffaloes and Mantic Coins. Uh, Lemonhead and Ken PV. So, long overdue mail day. Some of this stuff I've had for three weeks to a month already. This I've had for a couple months already. There we go. So that's going to be a nice little Hulk wall hanger. I'm excited about that. I've already looked at them. There's nothing special with them except for really nice BU, AU condition wheats. So I believe that's all I got. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. What's left of it and enjoy the week coming up. Y'all take care. Loose Coins is out.